Hey friends, welcome back to the channel. I am Cher and I'm super excited because my Ipsy boxes literally just hit my doorstep. Not even five minutes ago. So you guys are going to come along and unbox them with me. I have not even opened it yet, so you're going to see my raw reaction. Today, we're going to cover the Icon box because I'm so excited for this one. And then I will share probably tomorrow or on another day, um, both BoxyCharm and Ipsy Glam Bag together. So if that interests you, you want to see what all we got inside the Icon box for February 2024, then stick around and keep on watching. Okay, guys, this is super exciting. So um, I'm filming this on the last day of January. I'm hoping I can get it up today so that it's in time for your choice day because Icon Box and BoxyCharm choice day starts tomorrow, the 1st through the 3rd of February, as well as for um, add-ons and all that. So I love it when I get it early so I can kind of help you guys. You can see some of the products. I also do try-ons. So after I get up all the unboxings, I will come back and do a full try-on video using all the products in our three different boxes, so make sure that you stay tuned for that. I don't know if that will be in time for your choices or not. Um, we'll try, but I don't know, but it will at least hopefully get the unboxings up. So let's see what all's inside. So if you've seen my um, spoilers video, videos and other ones, you'll know that it is curated this month by none other than Gwen Stefani. So we have a whole little newsletter this time. Gwen Stefani is blazing her beauty trail. Wow, they've got like a bunch of stuff in here. These are all the possible products we might be seeing. We've looked at some of them. How cute is she? Um, I'm thinking, so I've seen this look of hers. Oop. If I get that bright blue eyeliner, can you see that look? I'm going to try to recreate her look maybe in the trial video. We'll see. But if we have other palettes and stuff, I don't know. Or I may do a separate video of just a Gwen Stefani inspired makeup video. Something along those lines. So you guys stay tuned because I just feel so inspired by this look with her blue pops. But then she's got the one with her red lipstick, so I don't know. Okay, so anyway, just looking through the little newsletter that they're sending with us. I um, guess this is all the skincare that might be in here our different variations and all the makeup that might be in our different variations. So very nice. I don't think I've seen them do a bigger newsletter like this in the past. Have they? All right, let's see what's inside here. Okay. So starting off, oh my goodness, I'm so excited. I finally am getting to try some Rin skincare. I've been wanting to try it. This is the Glycol Elactic Radiance Renewal Mask with AHA. Um, clean to skin, brightens and smooths. So we'll open her up. Here is what it looks like. A little squeezy on top. Just kind of do a little, there we go. There is a look at the texture. And it does have like gritty, a little bit of grit in it, but very, it's like a gel grit. And smells, um, how does that smell? It smells clean, but like bright, to like, what is that scent in it? I don't know what is in this that's making that smell. I mean, like it smells vitamin C-ish, you know what I mean? But I don't know if it has vitamin C. Um, yeah, like a, a gel, but it's, I don't want to say it's sticky. It's a little thicker gel with grit in it is the best way I know how to describe it. So anyway, but I'm super excited to get to try this out. I will, I usually do the skincare try-ons also in my try-on box, in my try-on video. Um, so I try to, you know, put it on as best as I can. Okay, awesome. We have some ABH. I love ABH. Now I already have this though. Um, this is the ABH Brow Freeze uh, Brow Styling Wax. So not new for me, but I will always take more. I love the brow wax. I mean, it's definitely a favorite. If I can get it open and just give you a feel for it, the texture. So yeah, this just really helps with like the feathery brows, um, a hold and freeze on the brows. And I do love it. I've actually got one in my kit. 
one in my personal use and now I'll have a backup one. So, and then it comes with the spoolie, which I don't, I don't usually have the spoolie, so that's good. So you use the little spoolie to apply it. So I am excited for that. I love ABH bra freeze, so I will take it again. Oh, yay. I was hoping to get it. The Dominique Cosmetics Essential Palette. So very exciting. So we're going to have a palette to play with for sure. Hooray. Let me get it open here. Here it is. Ooh, it's so like, it's kind of bougie in the packaging. Um, Kind of like a glass finish, you know, not necessarily glass, but like, you know, a little heavier than I pictured. And here it is inside. Very nice. Um, is it like Valentine's themed dish? Eh. I mean, you got a little bit of like pinky and stuff, neutrals and a smoky. So I feel like there's a lot you can do with it. I love how it says beauty inside and out. Y'all want me to go ahead and swatch it? I will. You know, I will. Well, let me go ahead and swatch off camera so I don't take up your time and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I always accidentally start twisting it on my arm. Not very well. Here is a look at the swatches. Um, these colors, I'm not feeling like they show up as well on my skin tone. Now, I like all these pretty shimmery, um, soft, you know, the shimmers and the pinks. But I do feel like they're just not popping a lot on my skin. Ooh, that's pretty. It kind of almost just looks like highlight to me, which is very pretty. The mattes, I'll be honest, are a little patchy going on and not super pigmented. Um, but we'll play with it more on the face in the trial video. But I just wanted to give you a feel for the color story on, like swatched up. I mean, I do feel like there's a lot you can do with it. I'm just, uh, swatching is not going on as pigmented as I would think, but... I especially had a hard time with this light color right here, which is this one. It was really breaking up on me. So we'll see, but it has so much potential on the pretty, like I really want to play with these soft shimmers. This is a whole row of four shimmers in a row here. Actually, you know what? The whole top are shimmers now that I think about it and the bottom row are all mattes. This one's a shimmer, but it's a little more silky. Whereas these are more um, flaky, glittery kind of almost. But yeah, all shimmers and then all mattes down here. This is a really pretty color. That right there. Okay, yeah, you can see the shimmer more here. Yeah, so I really want to play with all these with the shimmers. So anyway, but it's beautiful. It's beautiful. We'll just see how the formula does. Next up, we have... Give Beauty. Is this our only give? You guys, I was afraid of this. That I wasn't going to get a whole lot of Give Beauty, which is her makeup line. Gwen Stefani's makeup. Oh, no, I got two. Uh, okay, I got two Give products. We'll open the, the ones. So, this looks like it's a lipstick, but it does not look like her red one. See, I was thinking in the spoilers we were getting the red, and what they showed us was the her, like, classic red. I like her packaging. Okay, it looks like one of those refillable ones. Oh, it's a beautiful color, though. I do love that color. Let's swatch it. Ooh, yeah. I'm excited about that lip. Ooh, oh, that's pretty. It does have kind of like a burnt rose shade to it, doesn't it? That is beautiful. It's just not the red that I was expecting. You know, her, her classic red, like... Okay, how does this go back in? I always, I'm not very good at these that are like the refillable kind. Now that was the shade Tragic Me. So I don't know if like everybody will get different shades or what, but um, yeah. <laughs> and then the other one from her line, Give Beauty, is the lip, I mean the eyeliner. The uh, Line It Up eyeliner. I hope this is the blue. I think it is. Yep. So the shade on this is Bathwater. And that's that classic blue you saw under her her eyes. It looked so good on her. And I cannot wait. I I just, I've been wanting to play with that look. Woo, look at that pop. Gorgeous. So yes, we're going to have some fun. 
Um, I don't know if the palette's gonna go well with the eyeliner, but I've been dying to use this eyeliner, so yay! Okay, so I can look like Gwen Stefani. Next we have um, Kat Von D Beauty, and this is the Full Sleeve Long and Define Tubing Mascara. More mascara, I've got so much. Here is the packaging, very nice. I mean, that's very nice. Oh, it looks good. It looks like we got some volumizing probably. So that is the wand. And then we have the Sachawan. I always pronounce it wrong, I think, heat protectant hair cream. I'm very excited to try this. I need some. Let's just see texture wise what we got going on. Ooh, smells good, smells like hair product. <laughs> Um, creamy, I'll show you. That is what it looks like. I'm glad it's a hair protecting, so very nice. Okay, then the last thing in here that we have, oh, okay, I got the, I got some fragrance. Y'all know I'm not a fragrance person, but we'll try it. Maison Louis Marie, number 13, Nouvelle Vague, and the notes, the top notes are Mouet, Coconut Waters, and Limid. The mid notes are Tuscan Fig, Tonka, and Agave, and the base is Vetiver, Amber, and Santal. Santal, Santal, and we'll try to open it up. Y'all are going to get me starting on perfume before you know it, and here we are, very fancy. I can't tell, is that a full size, y'all? Like, it looks small to me, but that may be the full size. Y'all know I'm not a perfume gal. This is how it comes. I will smell it and just see what I think. And it's the roller kind, so. I'm sorry, guys. I'm not a perfume person. This just smells like a man to me, <laughs> personally. I, yeah. You guys might get really excited about this. I'm just, I'm... I'm a fruity and like tropical girl. So like, I like like fruity body sprays and stuff. Not a perfumey. I mean, it's very like elegant. Yeah, I don't know how to explain it. I'm not a perfume person, guys. So <laughs> I can't help you with that one. But that is everything in my box. So um, what do you all think? I am excited to have two Give Beauty products. I was hoping for the Give Beauty for sure. And I'm really excited that I got this palette. So excited for that. I mean, I'm happy with everything. Um, those are probably the ones that I'm the most like tickled about. So what about you guys? What did you think? Yeah, so make sure that you stick around for my BoxyCharm and Glam Bag unboxings next, as well as for the full try-ons of everything. And if I can't pull off a Gwen Stefani look in that video, I might just do a separate Gwen Stefani look of some kind. So be watching for that too. So you definitely want to hit subscribe, stick around and turn the notification bells to on so you don't miss all this fun. And I also do a lot of beauty boxes here on the channel. Lots of spoilers for Ipsy as well as other ones, unboxings and try-ons. So you don't want to miss it. All right, guys, I will catch you on the next one. I hope you have a great choice day tomorrow. And yeah, let me know how it goes. I'll talk to y'all then. Bye.